This is my attempt to do the George Shearing kind of sound. Again, Shearing used to go on the road with the guitarist and the vibraphonist. And you can do both assigning mallets to Thank you. 
Okay, we're going to uh, end the formal pre-programming part of the concert now with a piece that we developed just over the last two days. It's kind of hard to bring this stuff out and not give people the chance to play it. And in fact, we had it in the Simon's Rock cafeteria yesterday for lunch. John's daughter was playing it. Friends came up to play it. Everybody played it back at the house while we were staying, while we stayed there. Uh, and this is both the lightning and the luminous. It's kind of hard to keep your hands off the instrument. So I put together a sort of a training wheel piece for John. It's an open form improv. Now, and we still have a few tricks on our sleeves or, or in our pockets. And there is no score yet. This is a head job here, and John has to be reminded what he needs. I need to remind him too. You need yellow mallets. So we've seen mallets before. You need the pedal. Make sure the light is turned on and the right patch. We're going to try to fuse both instruments in a way that, that I did also in, in the beginning. We're going to share wands, which I'll hand out at a later time. And there, there's something else you haven't seen yet about <coughs> these things. Whoop! Whoop! Catch it! Pucks! <laughs> All these pucks are, are substitutes for the extra two mallets. I guess I haven't really explained how this thing works yet. Uh, radio frequency. The, the wands are infrared light. The marimba lumina is radio frequency. There are actually pairs of antennas underneath every one of these bars. And there are resonant coils, just a little winding of wire in each of the mallets. And they have different numbers of windings, so they resonate at a different radio frequency. And this thing is pinging in the ether. You don't want to put your radio in your marimba lumina. You want this turned on. Uh, at four different frequencies and trying to track, track these mallets. So instead of using the, the green and blue mallet, I have a green and blue puck, which we will also share. <laughs> <laughs> so I Luminous. 